In the deep blue depths of the underwater world, the shark gang found a treasure chest glowing with gold while they were on the hunt for fresh prey. They just started circling around. They tried to open the chest with their sharp and huge teeth, but they failed. It's locked so tight it won't open. The chest is full of gold for sure. Look how it shines. <laughs> Do you think it's enough to buy the underwater kingdom? <laughs> <laughs> the scary shark gang created a sea hose with a quick wag of their tails to open the chest. But the box didn't move even just a little bit. This time, the sharks tried to cut the chest with their pointed fins, but the chest was still not opening. As a last resort, they had bitten the chest in one swift move with their frightening teeth. But the chest was still not opening. There must be a way to open this chest. The shark gang threw sand at the chest with their noses so no one else could see it. At that moment, a light came out of the keyhole of the chest, flew over the sand and disappeared. It shines so bright! Someone will definitely see it! We'll never be able to hide it! Meanwhile in the Earthland, Prince Edward and Mermaid Aria were traveling by ship when they saw a relief bottle floating on the water. Quickly, bring me that bottle! A soldier and his crew caught the bottle with a long net and handed it to Prince Edward. This must be a letter of aid, my prince. The prince took the note out of the bottle. Our island heritage, hidden for centuries in a golden chest, has been lost. If we don't find it, our island will be in darkness forever. Written by Shadow Island People. As I guessed, the Shadow Island People need my help, my prince. Otherwise, the sun will not rise on the Shadow Island. Aria jumped into the sea without wasting any time. Her feet turned into a mermaid's tail as soon as she entered the water. She looked deep into the coral reefs to find the chest, but couldn't find it. She wandered among the sea plants, but the chest was not there either. When she fell into despair, she saw the brightly shining chest. At that moment, three sharks tried to carry the golden chest with their noses. I'm gonna buy the kingdom of Poseidon with the gold in this chest! And I'm gonna get my dental veneers with the gold in this chest! <laughs> and I'll buy a dolphin and get on it and ride around! <laughs> hey! Quickly get away from that chest! You should not touch other people's belongings without permission! The chest belongs to the Shadow Island residents! The shark gang started circling around Aria to scare her. Ah, everything in these seas is ours, little mermaid! Just as the shark gang was about to attack the little mermaid, Aria swam away with her powerful fishtail and easily took the golden chest and moved away. The shark gang was shocked that Arya was able to get the chest so easily. They immediately started chasing after her. We found the chest! It's ours! Leave it right now! Arya went through a rock hole with the chest to avoid the sharks that were fast after her. Even though the two sharks of the gang were able to get through the hole, the boss shark got stuck inside it. Save me! I'm stuck between the rocks! Ah! When the gang sharks couldn't save their boss from the hole, they left him there and went after Arya greedily. After swimming for a while, they saw a green tail behind the mossy sea rock ahead. We found you, you little mermaid! Surrender or be ready to fight! The moment one of the sharks bit the tail behind the rock, he started trembling. Because the tail he bit off belonged to an electric eel. I guess I won't be able to move! You go after the chest! 
The other shark got greedy and went after the chest alone. Meanwhile, little mermaid Aria got tired of carrying the chest and slowed down. Seizing this opportunity, the shark was about to sneak up and catch Aria. But Aria got rid of the shark with the small waves she created by waving her tail from side to side. Immediately after, she threw the chest towards the surface of the water with all her might and she swam in the opposite direction, confusing the shark. Should I catch the chest or the mermaid? Chest or mermaid? Chest or mermaid? Just then, the chest fell on the shark's head and the shark was thrown into the depths of the sea. And Arya took the chest and swam quickly to the ship. As soon as she jumped on the deck, the fishtail turned into a human foot again. The prince was very happy when he saw the chest in Arya's hand. <laughs> My prince, let's go to the island without delay and return the chest to the rightful owners. The Little Mermaid Aria and Prince Edward have delivered the chest to the Shadow Island residents. The people on the island were so happy that they immediately opened the lid with excitement. There was only one lamp in the chest, but this lamp was magic. Thus, the Island of Shadow suddenly turned into an island of light and became illuminated. Aria and Prince Edward set sail again from this bright island. At that time, the Shark King found another treasure chest deep in the sea. Whoa, look! Another treasure chest! The evil Shark King happily approached the chest and suddenly a huge yellow octopus came out of the chest and jumped at them. He threw each of them far away with his arms. No! No! <laughs> After that day, the members of the Shark Gang understood that other people's belongings should not be touched without permission, albeit with difficulty. Adi's <laughs> Nebaba. <laughs>